Well, the general election was more than a month ago, but the race for district attorney in Schuylkill County is so close, it's not over yet. The incumbent has asked the courts to order a recount, and as Matthew Petrillo tells us, the fight is still on. At county court today, a judge heard testimony that could decide who the next Schuylkill County District Attorney will be, either incumbent Democratic District Attorney Karen Burns Noon or Republican Christine Holman. The November 5th voting showed Holman defeating Karen Burns Noon by less than 100 votes, but Burns Noon is challenging those election results. Her lawyer argued today that a ballot machine malfunctioned on election day and fixing it while people were voting may have caused human error. Somewhere between 36 to 40 ballots had to be inputted by this computer tech from another state. That's not all. He says he just learned Monday that the same scenario could have happened elsewhere. Members of the resolution board um, took other absentee ballots that there were problems with and created a, a new ballot and that was the one that was fed through the machine. Well, that's stunning. But Holman's attorney says those allegations don't seem to add up. We're quite surprised he keeps coming up with new facts, and I'm using facts loosely, but apparently he has a new allegation now about a crumpled piece of paper, which we've never heard until today, and we'll have to take it very seriously. She says the petition for a vote recount is invalid. Election contest simply cannot be brought. They had time to file uh, challenges to the absentee ballots. They did not do it, and they're now trying to make up for mistakes that occurred before. Burns Noon's lawyer will file a petition Tuesday, and they could be back in court for a hearing as early as Friday. Matthew Petrillo, News 13, Pottsville.